hi guys welcome to my channel so this is a reading for the sign of pisces pisces my readings are timeless so when you see them is when you're meant to hear them please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe also don't forget to hit the post notification bell so you get alerts when my videos are posted so pisces i'm hearing more with less Somebody is mad with you because you did more with less. So somebody has more than you. Or I guess they think they have more than you because technically you have more love, more just you have more character <laughs> than whoever this person is. But either way, this person is apparently supposed to be somebody um of a higher stature in life or statue stature in life than you are meaning this person made more money than you in your lifetime and apparently you did more with less so this person is upset that you have guidance and direction and purpose when you spend your money and they obviously didn't. So I'm hearing very materialistic people that like to, you know, be flashy and front for the lights and spending money in ways that really didn't serve them anything. And now these people are looking at your life, mad at you. And how are you gonna be mad at me if you made more money than me. How are you going to be mad at me if you think you're better than me? Why are you even looking at me if you think you're better than me? That's what I don't understand. Um, Pisces, there's also been a thing, uh, the energy, the money shift, things like this happening. And these aren't much, but it's been checks coming in the mail. And it's like, um, in close, please, please find a check. This check represents your settlement payment in a lawsuit. And it's like a, a, a um, class action lawsuit or whatever. And I don't know when or how this actually came about. But anyway, just check some of the mail from class action lawsuits. And again, like I said, they're not that much. But hey, shit adds up. So just receiving several of them. And just money coming out of nowhere from different places. So adding to your billionaire mindset or, you know, just money coming to you. So we have the King of Wands here, a natural leader, a visionary, an entrepreneur, somebody that can see the big picture, somebody that knows how to overcome challenges, a very mature energy, and somebody that's very career focused. They like to take charge, they know how to delegate, and they're very good at influencing others. This person is very good at very focused and, and very good at making things the way they want them. So we also have a queen of cups energy here. Um, somebody that's very compassionate. Somebody this is very comforting, very calm. They have a very calm and nurturing nature. They're very healing, very emotionally stable, very intuitive. And then we have rest and retreat relaxation, meditation, contemplation, recuperation, renewal, and solitude with the four of swords. So basically a need for seclusion to process your emotions. Emotions. Mm, what am I saying? Okay. So we have the star here, vision, hope, a direction. Um, this could also be seeking direction. This is also hope and healing, a calm, faith, your purpose, more renewal. So lots of healing vibes with the last two cards. Spirituality, fortune, a good omen, and rejuvenation. So the star is like a common influence and it brings in messages, messages of 
like things the universe is working in your favor giving you a direction okay so have faith in where you're going have faith in where the direction that you're being taken and, and things will be okay so just take it easy we have the eight of pentacles here working on your money hard work laying the groundwork working on your skills your talents learning new skills and talents focus on the task at hand being very diligent very passionate very having very high standards so character and moral morals and morale i was you know so being able to push yourself mastery skill development like doing repetitive tasks like continuing to do something and um not the definite not the definition of insanity but basically the other side of that the other coin side of that coin um consistency is the word being consistent at a situation and taking it all the way into follow through so working on your money manifesting money being very uh purposeful with your money where you putting it what you're doing and how you're handling things okay so again i don't know why i keep hearing that it's still more with less you have done more with less so somebody's upset i don't know if this is it's weird it's just a weird conversation being had right now okay so we have the will of fortune here um, good luck, karma, life cycles, destiny, um, a turning point, change, inevitable fate, ups and downs, something that's very unpredictable. Um, right now, I'm getting two people going on vacation um, or relaxing. Like, I don't know if this is like two people to getting to know each other or something. Two people getting to know each other. It's almost like trying to partner with a person to work on money but um this is karma like i don't know why it would be karma for y'all two to come together so i don't know what that is but apparently karma taking place and bringing two people together so um okay i'll take it <laughs> you're a good person they're a good person so y'all y'all karma is putting y'all together all right all right i like it um never heard of that before but okay y'all two people are two people that know how to do more with less okay so which is also giving me it's getting ready to build something big because now y'all have somebody to work with somebody that's on your level somebody that's the same somebody that's not lazy somebody that knows how to go get it make something shake okay I like where y'all are taking this. Look what I say. Because it was giving me where we get ready to go with this. Y'all got two, like, almost the same energy but different. Somebody, it's like y'all would need each other. She's very nurturing. This person is very, like, um, a leader. Although she could lead as well. But it's like giving me what a husband and wife would be like. A natural leader and somebody that's very comforting calm very nurturing very healing i like it okay all right pisces so if you're not with someone you're single and you're open to whatever this partnership is because i'm hearing we can be friends first and see where it goes so a new friendship coming in so celebrations friendships collaborations creativity friendships community and happiness and I'm also getting so community coming together. Once you two people coming together, it's like people gravitate towards you too. The star, they have a, they can see something in y'all too. Okay. Look at this shit. Okay. The world leveling up, completion, accomplishments, wholeness. Y'all two have healed. And then y'all coming together to heal each other. Y'all going to take a break and get to know each other. I like it um travel didn't i say travel going away yes i did celebration of life and arriving oh the world is leveling up closing one door and opening another one obtaining what you seek 
you are exactly where you're meant to be on your path. So y'all karma, karma is to celebrate and you're right on your path. So, wow. Okay. Okay. Yay for y'all. Um, Three of Wands here. Reaping the rewards. I mean, shit. I, I don't want to say I can't make this up because when I be watching Tarot Readers and they say I can't make this up, I'll I be like, bitch, you just did. So, bitch, I just did, okay? <laughs> but I can't make this up. Bitch, I just did. All right? So, take it how it resonates for you because, bitch, I just did. I mean, it's falling right in the line. Wish fulfillment at the bottom of the deck. Like, your wish is being fulfilled. So, I'm getting very intuitive vibes with you two. Enterprise. So, building a business. I'm getting... Well, I ain't going to tell y'all what I'm getting because that ain't y'all business. But expansion, because it's for whatever it is that you and your partner, whoever you're with. Because this could already be a husband and wife couple and still doing the exact same thing. But... It's not y'all business what they're doing. But overseas opportunities. So lots of travel. And while y'all traveling, y'all making money. Uh-huh. My type of shit. Look at this. While y'all traveling, y'all making money. Look at that shit fell out. Money. Look at God. I can't make this up. Bitch, I just did. <laughs> I like it. All right. So. Ten of Pentacles. Affluence, abundance, finding. Look at this. That's y'all judgment. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Y'all got divine calling judgment for y'all. Hello, 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 Pisces. Um, yeah. I like it. So, wealth, but first of all, back to this travel card. These are some good ass trips for y'all to be working and making money. Because I'm hearing paradise. This is paradise. Like the whole shit is paradise. Mm, mm, mm. And I'm hearing y'all are very responsible, even in the fact that y'all are doing this like it's like working and making money the places that y'all are traveling to paradise but you're going there for money that's the judgment y'all must have did some good ass shit okay excuse me Okay, I feel like I just want to end this reading because, listen, Pisces. So, Nine of Pentacles, fruits of your labor, rewards, luxury, self-sufficiency, financial independence. Like, coming in, look at the emperor sitting right here. Look, the emperor and the emperor's right there. King of Pentacles. All right, I got to go because, listen, this this is... They mad because you did more with less and the judgment call is for you to live a life of abundance. <laughs> I mean, what a punishment. Thank you, God. I like it. Pisces, enjoy your reading. Thank you for coming. Go with God.